Packaging. Packaging. Melissa Coronado. Can you guys see that? She got our Jairus joggers in gray. Another pair of Jairus joggers in gray. And the rose enamel pin. And this is her fifth order. So today, me and Tori are going to package. Good morning, XXL fam. So on Saturdays or Sundays, Tori, my best friend, comes to work with me. She helps me package orders, show you guys later, because I know, I know you love watching packaging videos. So I'm also talking really quiet because everyone is sleeping still. It's really early. After we package, we eat oatmeal together because we both love oatmeal. <gasps> oh my God. <laughs> I already prepped our oats, so I let them soak. By the time we eat in like five hours, the oats will be all good to heat up and eat. And when I first moved to Belleville, I think I was like 10 years old. I don't know, all I know is that I was in grade five and Tori was one of like the very first people I met, Parkdale Elementary School. Best friends ever since, like my childhood. Memories are with Tori, like we did the dumbest things. <laughs> Hi YouTube. Oh hi. How are you doing? <laughs> so <clears throat> so Tori has been part of the XXL team for a while now. I don't remember when exactly she joined, but I think it was like it was still 2020, like maybe October-ish, November-ish. My best friend, I couldn't be happier. But the amazing thing is that she has a full-time job, like Monday to Friday, 7 a.m. till 5 or 6 p.m. Then her weekends are her only free time, but she makes that time to come work here with me. That means so much. Because I remember when I used to work a nine to five, like Monday to Friday, weekends were like my time. Like I needed that. Thanks so much, Tori. Even though I'm gonna see you in a little bit. <laughs> Over 17 years of friendship. And it like never feels like work. It like, it just feels like we're hanging out. So I truly could not be luckier to like be working with my best friend. I'm gonna cry. <clears throat> no, I'm not. And then after we package, we always eat oatmeal together and we watch our show, Temptation Island. <laughs> Because season three is out and it's on weekly so we have like a show that we like to watch together while we eat our oatmeal but then after our oatmeal we do a little bit of elasticing tori also helps me do that part of my customer service she is head of our support email for xxl scrunchie and she helps me filter and manage our youtube content and Tori is also who I have the Victoria XXL scrunchie named after. And she's who I named the Tori crew after. So yeah, her full name is Victoria, but I also call her Tori. So I've been around for a while. It's like sweatpant material. Do you see that? Tori. Victoria. Melissa Coronado placed another order. Oh my god. Whoa, she got four things. Oh my god. Is the is scrunchie, scrunchie God's God listening? Was... She got the Victoria. I swear she's listening. Whoa. She got the Victoria, a bouquet sticker, holographic sticker, and the Bronte, the Bronte wow. What she got? Uh, Damn, Melissa. Thank you, Melissa. She's ordered five times. Aww. I know. I'm so happy. <gasps> These fuzz are everywhere, guys. Do you see that? And if you still want an XXL scrunchie named after you, I'm still, I'm constantly collecting names. We have a lot of scrunchies coming up, so if you want your name on my scrunchie list, just comment your name and your favorite color. I swear there's something in my eye. I'm not crying, I swear. Ew, I think I got it. When there's orders, we get their name written on these cards, so I'm gonna write all those names. You can watch. I usually write with a sharpie and I... 
thick Sharpie and I can't find one, so. Oh, I have two here. Wow. Guys, this is pretty rare. Usually we get some orders that are the same name in a row, but we just had a Hector Alamillo and a Hector Garcia. They both are two separate people. Both ordered like in a row. That'd be really cool if they ordered the exact same thing. Like, whoa. Did you oh. see that there was two Hectors in a row? Oh, that's so weird. Right? Oh my God. Right after another. That's There's a special offer on the back for purchasers that they can redeem to get a special discount code on a future order. So that's what these cards are in case you're wondering what they were. We get our stuff printed from Staples, Vistaprint, and we've also tried Moo. These are like our old cards. I used to print them just on business cards. So yeah, I always leave a space to write their name. I have so I've had so many different designs. Like I have this one. Ooh, I have this one. Scrunchy ice cream cone. Do you see that? See, I love snacks. I use this app called Ship Station to ship all of our labels. The weights and the dimensions for me automatically go because I've set like automated rules based on orders. So I just have to like go in and click on every order just to double check everyone's shipping is like the correct one just in case. And print the labels. Integrates with my Shopify site. In case anyone's wondering, in case that helps anybody out. So as you guys can see, they selected this tracked expedited. So it automatically enters in the weight because all of my scrunchy weights are entered in there. We just have 29 from yesterday that we're going to package out. Scrunchies. Scrunchy, scrunchy. Then we have it hooked up to our thermal printer. Oh, the labels ran out. Oh my God. Oh my God. How do I open this? Oh my god. Ah. So heavy. Ah. Oh yeah. Gotta grab the names of the orders. So as you can see, we printed off all of those. So trans label is on the top. And then when we package, I look here on my iPad and go down. I'll open the iPad and I'll scroll down to order number 9594, which is oldest order we haven't packaged yet. So I'll tap her order. I'll see all the scrunchies here. And then I grab it, grab a sticker, grab her name. I'll grab her order and pack it over to Tori and give her the necessary packing things that she needs to put everything in the envelope, stick it, and then we move on to the next. It took me a while to like get the hang of our workflow. Like we used to do it a way different way that would take way longer. So hope who's ever watching this, this helps you organize your workflow a bit better because this is by far the best way that we've been doing for a while and it's super quick, but efficient. <gasps> Waiting for Tori to come. Tori's here. Let's go get her. Uh, I lost my Crocs. Tori's here. <laughs> Roger's gonna get mad. Uh oh. <laughs> And we're back. back. Oh no, I have one in four by four mode. <laughs> Sorry, I'm about to be so awkward. <laughs> we should do our handshake. Oh, I forgot. I forgot. It's been so long. Okay, so it's really, come back here. It's really messy and chaotic back here because I ordered 54 of these 
and Cindy was like, why don't you just stack them in front of this? And then this becomes storage, right? Cause look, we already put a bunch of stuff behind there. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Better. I have so much more room now. And then come look in the in the sewing room. You go first. Okay, sorry. sorry. I'm <laughs> <laughs> okay, the shelves to the right here are gone. Whoa. Because this was taking over out there mm -hmm. and I need it here now. Yeah. So all those bins are arriving on Wednesday when Cindy comes, so then we can bring it all downstairs. Cause, it looks so good. Right? Mm -hmm. And we're running out of room. Cindy Aubrey Lily. Should we film our OV? <laughs> I was thinking. I feel like maybe it would become famous. A like real Gigi recipe? Had eats pasta. <laughs> <laughs> XXL scrunchies the oatmeal? Yeah. Aw. <clears throat> you never know. I just feel like people would be scared of the greens. You gotta do it. 
Okay, I took a photo of me soaking them because I left my camera downstairs. Ooh, two Juliets. So the Juliets, mm. Cause they're gone, but they're they still exist. Metal off. Jarrah's joggers, Whoa. a small and a medium. And she got a Bronte bomber. Whoa. And the Victoria. Thank you, Melissa. Some stickers, sticker, sticker. Look at that. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. But she's so cool, I'm gonna give her a five off coat. Got so many goodies. Almost done. Last mm -hmm. one. Neck off. You and I were both like yeah, juggling. <laughs> Quietly struggling. <laughs> I couldn't decide if that was the bag I wanted. I was like, oh, it's too late. I'm grabbing it. We're done packaging order. We're done packaging order. Now we get to eat our oatmeal, our proats. Should we give her a cool bag? Yeah. Yeah. Just for you, Melissa. Oh yeah. So fun. So cool. So I've ordered the paper samples. Oh, you did? Yeah. Cool. They're gonna look like this, but. The background will be brown, and then this will be black. Ooh. Ooh. Um, so we have to stick it on here. Okay. Because it doesn't stick as well on the black part. Sometimes, yeah. Which hurts my OCD a little. Yeah. But, yay! We're done! Oatmeal time. Down. When me and Tori filmed the oatmeal, we didn't hit record or something, and I need to pay justice to this oatmeal. So I'm gonna record what I'm eating this morning because I eat it every single day. Good morning. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Wow. So first, flax seeds, and yes, we put it in this container. Oats, chia seeds, and a bowl. So that's about like 30 grams. I used to measure it with a scale, but memorize it. And then I let it soak with a half cup of water for like, I guess it's like 9 a.m. now. And then I let it soak until like noon when I eat it. Or I just microwave it right away and just pour the water in and do it right away. I'm not going to let it soak because I'm hungry and I'm going to eat it now.
you microwave it for a minute 30. Oh, it's so nice outside. Can't even see. Put sunscreen on, guys. Even though I'm not going outside because I saw this TikTok where this truck driver like didn't wear sunscreen and he stayed in his truck the whole time and then the right side, whatever side of his face was to the window was like significantly more sun damaged than the other one and he didn't wear sunscreen. So now this whole myth of you don't get a tan from being inside because you're in windows and windows protect you is like fact that I thought was true because one girl in high school said it. It's been a lie my whole life. Whoa, it's getting steamy on the camera. And that is what it looks like right now. Okay, my ball. father's here. He's gonna help me film it. Yeah, because me and Tori <laughs> tried to film it and didn't hit record. Okay, so I like to put greens in it because I don't like to drink my greens. But you can barely taste the greens. It's so fun you filming. The protein powder. It's a pro! <laughs> put one scoop of protein powder in it and it's cookies and cream and I've been eating this for the last like three years and look at the scoop it's on top just like that to get easily I just do a scoop like that I don't think I put enough water so I'm gonna put another half maybe a half of a half and then we stir it's really good trust me okay and then the last trick that I got from this Instagram girl Jill Christine fit re microwave it yeah 30 seconds and it's done yeah and that's how you eat it yeah so 30 more seconds hmm. what should we talk about it's nice out I already said that. Oh, you can show Raji waiting for his breakfast. Aww. Aww. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. It, it, what do I say? It uh, tastes better than it looks. Yeah. That's what you're trying to say. Yeah. Ta da. Ta da. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, if I was like the younger us and I was like, this is what we'll be doing in 15 years. The exact same thing we were doing at that time. I also want to do this new thing where I do like small business shout out because I feel like that would be fun to include in all my videos as like a So there's this business Let me look it up to properly share They are just so thoughtful like I I I'm shocked how thoughtful they are to me So they're called Heather Case Handmade Sustainable Women's Wear Handmade in Canada Pretty sure she's in Belleville. Small batch made to order DM to purchase or shop online. And her stuff is so like, like, I need to get some. This is why she just shocked me. Charlotte, our XXL photographer, love her so much. She said, hey, so Heather Case is doing a shoot of some of her new pieces on Saturday and has, hey Roger. Okay, so Charlotte messaged me and was like, hey, so Heather Case is doing a shoot of her new pieces on Saturday. She opened the invitation for me to come along. The space is in Belleville and the space looks sick. I actually saw it when I was browsing for warehouses. She said the girls modeling love XXL and she said she'd sure they would love to model. I don't know if I would be able to shoot all the new ones. I wouldn't want to take all her time away. Some scrunchies that you wanted me to shoot, I could possibly do that for you. And then I messaged her and was like, what? Wait, what? And she's like, yeah, she said if there's any XXL shots that I may need to get, I was more than welcome to shoot them. 
I'm just like shocked. This is so cute and nice of her to offer. Included her like four minis. Oh, I wish I took a picture of the gift box. I made her four minis and then I included her one of our pins so I really hope she likes it and then for all the models I included them a free XXL with the matching mini that they get to keep she is like a fellow small business owner and thought like to message Charlotte to tell me like oh if you have some feel free to just use my models that I'm already organizing to go shoot in my space like like just out of the kindness and thoughtfulness of her brain oh my god but to be offered that it's a lot of time and like money and like efforts and like now i get to stay here and package and do what i need to do because otherwise i wouldn't have these photos i love photos i haven't thought to reach out for models yet also like pandemic times so i wanted to give out a shout out to her business you guys should go check it out heather case handmade clothing also shout out to my dad because last minute i kind of forgot to organize the scrunchies because i wanted her to shoot the new ones and i didn't finish sewing them yet so i finished sewing them last night at like midnight like the last seam close of the new colors to give them and then my dad woke up this morning and dropped it off at her house at 7 30 in the morning love him i would have done it but he said he would do it for me i'm not crying i swear until next week xxl fam love you how sick is this denim xxl scrunchie and i was explaining the name of the victoria scrunchie when I was talking on that and then someone ordered it. Really? Yeah. I was like, what did I do that one time? A shirt or something? Oh yeah, the Tory On a live, yeah. yeah. And so I was like, what size is it? And I said the sizes and she was like, great. And then she bought it.